Hi, my name is McKenna. I'm Michael. And I'm Mackenzie. Be sure to like and subscribe to Mr. Tadero's class. We were reading the report card. Have you ever came home with all D's and one C with all your siblings being super smart? Um, imagine if that happened to you and you and you had to read them out loud in front of your smart siblings and your parents that think you are a genius. The book's author is Andrew Clemens. This book got a reward for William Allen White Children's Book Award. It was awarded in 2005. It is a kind of it is kind of a part of a book series because all of his books have the same concept. This book was published in 2004. This book genre is children's literature. We chose this book because we wanted a book about a kid our age and to know what it felt like to get bad grades. The lesson of this book is to never hide your grades in your full in your full potential. Our story takes place at a few different places. The first place is at Nora's house, the second place is at her school. The main characters are Nora and her best friend Stephen. Important characters are Anne, Todd, Nora's mom, and Nora's dad. My favorite character is Todd because he is very funny throughout the book. My favorite character in the book is Nora because she tries not to tell her parents facts that she finds out about herself during her life. My favorite character is Steven because I think he is just a cool character to be in the book, we, although we liked all the characters in our book. At the beginning of the story, Nora's mom thinks Nora is as smart as her brother and sister because they were in the Gifted and Talented program. Short for that is GTP. Then, in the middle of the story, Nora comes home with D's and, and C's on her report card, but she won't show her family, and at their school, they're making such a big deal about grades and start giving her a bunch of tests to see who is smart to get them in the GTP. The big problem in the story is that her school is making such a big deal of her grades, they try to make everyone in the school to get a zero on every test. We are going to write a letter to Andrew Clemens to tell him how much we enjoy his books, and I hope you will too. We really encourage you to read this book. It, it is a really fun book to read, and be sure to watch out for our next book review, The Lunch Money, by Andrew Clements. Be sure to like and subscribe to Mr. Tadero's class. Bye! Bye.